Hello, welcome back to the channel. Uh, this is the continuation of the last episode of um, Ghost Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. Um, let's get straight back to it. I don't know why That's I'm doing that. There we go. Yuri and El Polito. You're a key part of Santa Blanca's security operation. Remember to check out Bowman's briefing on the chain of command. The guy in charge of security is El Muro, the wall, personal bodyguard and childhood friend to El Sueño. El Muro's little brother is looking. I like my MP5, but my backup weapon, I do want to have the ability for sniper rifle, so let's have a look, see what I've got. Oh, what have I got access to? Blogger, nasty piece of shit. Very active on social media. Head Sicario for the cartel. The hunt starts now. We want Sueño, we gotta work our way up the hierarchy. First targets are Yuri and Polito. We find the intel, we track them down, we take them out. Check it out, weapons case. Okay. Let's get in the helicopter, because why not? Our pilot. Nomad, I've got Pat Katari on the line. Sounds like he needs our help. Put him through. Hola, compadre. I have a problem in Itaqua. Bowman says you might be able to help. My people need help. There have been many losses to the cartel, and the horrors inflicted by Yuri Polito have broken their spirit. The fires of revolution have almost gone out. Spare me the rhetoric, Katari. Just tell me what you need. There is a cartel supply convoy passing through the province soon. Capturing it would give my people much needed supplies and restore their morale. Can you do this? Consider it done. We're taking orders from Pat Katari now? Katari needs this convoy. We are gonna give it to him. The more he depends on us to get shit done, the more we can get out of him in return. Okay, so... Where is this convoy? I'm in the sky at the moment, so... Give me a minute to land. Let's select that. Ready? 
Ready? Open fire. Roger. That truck's hightailing it out of here. I have a shot. Engage it. HVT spotted. Looks like a top Sicario. Time to have a chat with him about his career choices. Shit, they spotted us. Come on, guys, assault. Escort destroyer. That truck's trying to get away. Grenade! Escort vehicle destroyed. Dismount, secure the area. Hey, leave him alone already. Don't fucking move. Enemy down. Good work. I'll ping the rebels and let them know where they can pick up their meds. Let's get out of here. Come on, get on. Get in. Come on, let's go. primary smuggling node for the cartel. They're using cutting-edge techniques to move product over the border and security is tight. You'll have to gather intel on the network as you go and find ways to disrupt it. What do we know about the asshole in charge? The Buchan's name is El Gato. Fair warning, he's got a reputation for being unkillable. He obviously hasn't met us yet. Got any background on him? I'll put together what we've got and send it to you shortly. Copy that. Got any leads for us? Just one. An unconfirmed report that El Gato set up one of his chemists with a special lab inside a Santa Blanca church. Church. I'm sending you the location now. You'll understand what's getting. Bowman sending some background on Elgato. The dude that thinks he can't be killed? This ought to be good. I'm getting out of the sky and taking this car. Just crossed into Barvechos. Good news. Flanio sent an accountant named Polpo to Barvechos to check out Nidia Flores' books. Word is Polpo is a hawk. He doesn't let anyone cut any corners. So whether she's skimming from Sueño or not, Nidia is not happy to have Polpo looking into her. The cartel smuggles its profits into Barvechos from Brazil, and the most of that gets laundered through Banco de Barvechos. With Polpo already about to gum up the works, there has to be some way we can use that to sabotage the entire process. Maybe Sueño already believes Nidia Flores has sticky fingers. To know for sure, we need to get hands on Popo. Our intel places his junior partner and right-hand man, a guy named Wagner. That's a side mission. Where's the real mission? Oh, let's do that. At a silver mine in Barbados. Okay, Wagner. let's Make do this. A friendly neighborhood CIA officer just sent us a video. Who's got the popcorn? You may not have met him, but you all know Ricky Sandoval, the man at the king's right hand, the guy whispering in his ear, the guy handing down justice and shit. You might not know Ricky was acting a little crazy the last couple of months. It happens, right? Everybody gets a little high on their own supply. They get short tempered and crazy fire. strong. But when you're home, ready? Like the fire, fire, fire. Opening fire on these fuckers. Your LT is trying to run. Hey! I'm talking to people that was that's like a very cool. Santa Blanca's coke smuggling operation. 
Bowman's got files for us on all the major players. Woman in charge is Nydia Flores, an ex-beauty queen to a drug trafficker. Her right-hand man is a dude named El Boquito. Ugly motherfucker. Seems to handle on the ground. My bad. She's the brains, he's the brawn. The asshole got away. That's the opposite of the Again. Fucking hell. Enemy down. We're cool. We're cool. Jesus Christ, okay. Um, right. We need a new vehicle. Probably take this one. Right. Go. Get in quickly. Let's get out of there. Let's do the side mission properly now. I'm engaging tangles. Let's watch this quick video. All the Sicarios in the world ain't worth piss if you don't have the accountants to watch the money clean. Octavio Allende is the accountant that does Sueño's laundry. They call him El Pulpo, the octopus, because he's got his tentacles everywhere. You take him out, a lot of other pieces no longer connect, but I want to use him as a weapon. Pulpo is management, and he knows it. Instead of an AK-47, he has a briefcase, and he uses it to open doors to businesses. To cement relationships with politicians and police. And to make the cartel's money something they can spend. Thanks to El Pulpo, in addition to its illegal enterprises, Santa Blanca has its cash in numerous legit businesses. El Sueño has brought El Pulpo to Bolivia to audit Nidia Flores. Cash from Brazil comes into Barvechos, where much of it is laundered into the mining consortium. Nidia's profits must be looking a little light. Okay. Back it up. I needed to keep him alive so we could frighten him and everyone he knows. How'd we fuck that up? Jesus Christ, okay. Let's take this thing. Bird on patrol, watch out. Right. Let's do a proper mission a second. Lieutenant. Yeah, so we need to interrogate this guy.
Silenzio, Marche. Only one way you're walking away from this alive. I'll talk, okay? Just come down. Got the location for a rebel radio station. Let's find it and fire it up. Right, where is this radio station? Oh, I forgot to grab the intel. Okay, we're cool. Yo, we got Una down. Got 20 on a cartel supply chopper. We should grab it for the rebels. Right. So, looks like we need to go there. But, may as well do that. I gotta spot you. How'd you go? Fire. Well, I'm opening fire. Supply truck's getting away. That's no, not. There. Gasoline secure. Ready for the rebels to come get it. That's what I call a full service outfit. Oh, I've just been shot. Jesus. Right, let's do that a second. Hopefully they will come and save me. Really hoping they'll come and save me, which they are. Good. God damn, that was close. Right. Pinpoint's one of the Sicario leaders for us. Let's use him to spread some anxiety. Come on, get in. Let's see what we've got. Okay. Let's we've go capture this guy. We've got a Santa Blanca chemist who's working on cutting edge smuggling solutions for the cartel. Go get this guy. I want to know what he's been up to. Definitely gonna need a new vehicle very soon. If not now at this point, Jesus Christ.
this could end up blowing up. Don't want to go in too close. Sniper, get the fuck down. The lieutenant's trying to escape. Let's get him. He's taking off. Ah, and I'm down. Thanks. I've got eyes on the chemist. Sniper, down, down. Jesus Christ. God damn it, right. Okay. On that note, I'm gonna say thank you very much for watching this episode of Tom Clancy's Ghost Recon Wildlands. Um, it's been fun. But. I got killed. So. Yeah, thank you very much for watching and uh, catch you later.